How would you describe what you hope this offense looks like this season? Um, how would I describe? If it's playing, if you guys are playing at your highest level, what's it look like? I mean, just violent football, run the ball. What gives you confidence you guys will be able to run the ball better than a, a year ago? Um, backs are doing a great job, and then, you know, our O-line is just amazing, in my opinion. You know, we've got great leaders and young guys who are stepping up into big roles, so. What's that competition been like? I know it's been a lot of guys moving around every day, and and a lot of guys competing for jobs. What's that been like in fall camp? Yeah, it's been a lot of fun. You know, Clanton, he, he wants us to compete, and you know, there's a word that we like to use, it's mudita, which is pure joy and other success. So, you know, you see other guys fit into different positions. And you can't help but be happy for them. And then you, you kind of um, walk out there with a chip on your shoulder and try and get that back, so. Jared Hufford was raving about Clanton's demand of versatility from all you guys on media day. What's, what's that been like just knowing that he wants you guys to know everything but he but he wants to simplify everything too so it, it, it seems like those two things will go go together but they seem to be going well. yeah yeah that um that in a nutshell it helps you learn the offense learn the plays and not just the position so you know I, you could go out there at any all five positions and be able to play because you understand the offense What's the general uh, excitement level just to finally have a game week and to, to start a, against a, a rival? Yeah, I mean, we've been working so hard since January. So just everything, being able to go out there on Saturday and be able to compete against a great team, it's exciting. They always come in really ready. Uh, you and I does pretty much every time they're here. Um, does that kind of heighten you guys too, just knowing that, you know, Early season games can be a little unpredictable, but typically they come in really, really ready. Yeah, I mean, it's another game, and like I said, they're an amazing opponent. They have a lot of great players, and, you know, they're, it's competition. They're going to be good. Mm -hmm. Some fans will say that they've heard going into every season that they're excited about the offensive line play. What, with all due respect, what makes this group and Coach Clanton and all you guys in this season different? Well, I'd say we, we're in older position as far as the O-line and then just kind of what Clanton wants us to work for. And, you know, he doesn't want this perfection in us. He wants this violent mentality. So just kind of instilling that in us has been good. Whoever uh, plays quarterback on Saturday, whether it's one or a combo, what do you just hope to see maybe out of out of that play early on? Um, I mean, we've practiced with a bunch of quarterbacks mm -hmm. um, during camp, so. Just, you know, we'll, we'll do a great job protecting them, and they'll do a great job making us right. What is it? What did it do for you mentally to have Clanton come in and say, I don't want you to be perfect, just be violent? I mean, that whole theme that he's, you guys have adopted and, and, and cherished, it sounds like. What, what was that like just to hear that, to not have to think that there's a voice in the back of your head? You're just going to go out there and maul people. Yeah, it makes uh, gameplay a lot easier. You know, you can just uh, get on the ball, you understand the play, and you just rage off the ball and try and try and look good out there and make make blocks and make the running back make cuts. So, what's it been like having Thanks. Coach Clan and having him just get hired from you and I to take that into your season opener? Has he given you any anything like that? Like this guy in the defensive line, if you chirp him a little bit, he'll come at you. No, not not so much that, but. I mean, he, he knows their D-line. He, when he coached there, he went against that same defense. So he has the ability to kind of just tell strengths and weaknesses as of players. And then, um, you know, as we watch film, we can see that as well. Did that come to you pretty easy from the takeaways you could take from the defensive line? Yeah, yeah.